building to a crescendo all week and very shortly it will be for real we have all the action for you live hello to you wherever you happen to be our action comes to you today from villa park i'm derek ray and keeping me company in the commentary box today is of course stuart robson and what we have on the menu is live action from the carabao cup it's Aston Villa versus Manchester United. Well, Derek, it's a nice break from league action today for these clubs. Obviously a long way to go in the tournament. The final is months away, but they want to put in a good performance and get through to that next round. This is the team Manchester United will go with. David De Gea begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And leading the attack today is Cristiano Ronaldo. Fractionally offside. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, Derek, he's the perfect finisher. He's got a great shot on him. His movement is excellent. And in 1v1 situations, you always expect him to score. Juan Bisaka. An effective challenge. Marvellous Nakamba. John McGinn. And super tackle and they've won possession. And showing fine vision. And Ronaldo just needs to remain level-headed. But can't avail himself of the chance. Will he be disappointed with that? Maybe it's just come a bit too early for him. Read it magnificently and intercepted. In with a chance. Not out of the woods yet. Well, they can keep possession now. Thomas. Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. Slipshod passing. Good work to regain possession. Jaden Sancho. Moving it forward. Chances on. Well, the keeper has outdone himself. Wonderful save. And now the delivery. A goal! 1-0! A fully deserved advantage based on what we've seen. Well, here it is again. It's a good delivery from the corner and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. The match has restarted. 1 0 here. Rafael Varan. Fine sequence of passes. Thomas now. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. Good physical play. Now what can they do from here? And a tidy tackle. There to win it back. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Sustained pressure and they have the ball now. I must say this looks promising. Oh, did so well to deny him.
He's driven in the corner. Well, the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Easy save for Davi De Gea. That's how to rob them of possession. The high press was on, and that's a fantastic tackle. Good bit of pressing. Able to get a body in the way. McGinn. Full credit. Wonderful stop. Who can he pick out? Mopping up defensively. Douglas Luiz. Failed to keep hold of it. Pedro Gonzalves. A really sumptuous ball. Bruno Fernandes. The crossbar got in the way. And clears the danger. Sancho. Well, had that gone in, they would be in complete control of this game. As it is, they're still going to be a bit nervy. And just missed that little bit of attacking spark. Goalkeeper's ball. Shaw. Thomas now. Douglas Luiz. Could be a chance to break here. Well, so many possibilities, but it didn't happen for them. Went in strongly to win the ball. Sancho. And United couldn't keep possession. Ronaldo. Can he make it count? Oh, not to be. That would have put them well on their way, Stuart. Well, that could prove to be a big miss. Surely has to score there. The referee has decided there will be just one minute of added time. Bruno Fernandes. And the whistle is sounded for half-time in this game. The teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences. Getting right on top of their opponents and winning it back. He made it look simple, really. Fred. Happy just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. Well, he's lost it. Young. Is it going to end up being productive for them? It's not a bad ball. Routine stop for De Gea to make. Foiling them effectively. I'm delighted to say more Premier League action coming up for you here on EA TV. It's Aston Hang on, Villa. Derek, it's a chance here. And under pressure, that was a fine claim. possession Pedro Gonzalves Fred with it Bruno Fernandes defensive efficiency personified splendid defending and it needed to be Wonderful save there. 
Well, he's given us away. So a half an hour remaining. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Manchester United facing Aston Villa. I must say this looks promising. But nothing comes of it. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. And back with Thomas. Fred. Thomas. Bruno Fernandes. Fred with it. And back with Thomas. Shaw. Thomas. Well, not hard to read that pass. Now far from a smooth challenge. Now will the referee produce a card? Well, deemed to have been a cautionable offence. Well, no question about it. He deserved his booking there. Spot on with that tackle. In a position from which they could potentially do a bit of damage here. Real chance. Well, just went a bit too early. Offside. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Twenty minutes to go. He's showing a real will to win the ball. Ings. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. And they have possession again. again Thomas Rafael Varan Nabil Fekir and nearing full time United inching ever closer to victory can they hang on Stuart your thoughts as regards their performance yeah, just about edging it overall. It's been a really tight game, hasn't it? Chances at a premium, and you have to praise their defending in that regard. Just got to see out the final few minutes now. No silly mistakes at the back. Oh, in with a chance. And a goal by Cristiano Ronaldo. So typical of him. Well, you have to admire this bit of play. Just look how he runs with the ball. He always looked in control, didn't he? That's a brilliant goal. Well, a second goal for them here. Douglas Luiz, committed challenge. Coming onto the pitch, number six, Paul Pogba. Pogba unable to keep the ball. Calero. That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. And threading it forward. In it goes! But it will not stand. Offside, Stuart. Well, it looked close, didn't it? He certainly thought so. He's making that clear to the linesman now. <laughs> Promising looking attack. Ramsey has it. He read the situation defensively and did his job. And back with Thomas. Jaden Sancho. And he's through here. Can they keep it out? High quality defending. Douglas Luiz. Ramsey has it. 
tackling and winning the ball to boot what about the stoppage time situation two minutes the word Sancho oh tremendous goal technical excellence to finish that one off wonderful to have that in your repertoire let's see this again because the delivery into the box couldn't be any better played into just the right area and what a great finish it is struck with power and accuracy certainly no stopping that and the visitors move on well the result was never in doubt was it they controlled the game from start to finish they created and Ronaldo just needs to remain level headed The unmistakable Cristiano Ronaldo in wonderful form. Can he add to his goal scoring haul today on EA TV? And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray in position to bring you live match commentary and my expert analyst as always on these occasions is Stuart Robson and it's all about action from the Premier League in this case it is Manchester United up against Aston Villa thanks Derek as always this should be a good game great atmosphere inside the stadium we've got two teams full of quality some interesting matchups and two coaches that want to play an attractive brand of football what more could you ask for Well, that's how to hit them. Not quite accurate enough, though. It must go in, surely. Well, making amends is all part of the game. Well, no wonder he looks relieved. That could have proved costly. Thomas. Aaron Wan-Bissaka. Cristiano Ronaldo. He's given it straight to the opposition. You know, when Ronaldo is on the pitch, we tend to think he'll stamp his authority on the game, Stuart. What in particular do you expect to see from him this time around? Well, he's had a terrific start to the season, hasn't he? He's been so lethal in front of goal. And while there's still a long way to go, he's very much on target to break the scoring record. Don't be too surprised if he notches another couple here today. Thomas. Now moving the ball impressively here. 
Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Thomas now. Shaw. Thomas. Fred. Is it going to be? Really sound goalkeeping. Well, that had to be a goal, didn't it? What a stop that is. Who's going to get on the end of it? And tipping it over the crossbar. And the corner has been given. Oh, a goal! And an own goal at that. Well, not part of the script, was it? Well, no question about this. As you can see, this will go down as an own goal. Well, that own goal has put them behind. Good tackle, take it away. Maguire. Here's Luke Shaw. Thomas. Raphael Varane. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. McGinn. And De Gea, absolutely brilliant goalkeeping. And he's fired over the corner. Well, no end product. Sanson. Well, you've got to classify that as a poor attempt. A long way wide. A news coming through of a goal in the Leeds match. Alex Scott, who has scored it? It's a goal for West Ham. It's now 1-0 with 20 minutes played. Alex keeping us right up to date. Shaw setting off perhaps a little bit too much here United might be able to cash in and Ronaldo prepared to fire foiling them effectively an unforced error you've got to say Fred Opportunity here. Well, full credit to him. He had the audacity to try it. Well, that's so close to being a lovely goal. It just doesn't come down in time. And there to intervene. Thomas now. Poor attempt at a pass, really. Ronaldo. Ronaldo! Might still be able to do a bit of damage. And the keeper nowhere to be found. Not that he's complaining. Well, just look at the defending here. They've made it so easy for him in the end. That's just not good enough. So, 2-0 now. Well, United have certainly controlled the ball, as you can see. And as a result, have dominated the game. Some of their passing movements have been a joy to watch. And I don't think anything's going to change that. Gives it a go. A smart stop here. Now, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. Playing with purpose and control. The cut back. Bruno Fernandes. Well, how about that for a piece of tackling to break things up? That's how to blunt the edge of the opposing attack. Pressing hot. Chances on. Ronaldo! Magnificent! 
magnificent finishing from one of the world's best. Well, let's take another look. If you lose the ball in those areas, you're going to get punished. And that's exactly what happened there. Blistering first half display. And just look at that score. Going well. Lovely work to get past his man. Well, how close was that? Inches away. Well, approaching half-time on the home side, very much in charge here, Stuart. Your thoughts? Well, what a first half. Really poor timing, and some will argue that he was asking for a yellow card. And a yellow card for that, Stuart. And he's going to have to be careful now. That was a silly challenge. Shaw. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Well, didn't go as a plan in the end. Ings and cutting inside an alert piece of defending well that's wonderful attacking play just made sure nothing came of that McGinn an effective challenge this might be ideal for the counter he's in here the crossbar that's what you call defending from the front possibilities here moving forward effectively a goal and I'll tell you what on this sort of form very few would lay a glove on them Well, when you see this again, the defending just isn't good enough. The clearance doesn't get enough height on it, doesn't get enough distance on it, and suddenly the ball's being played back into their danger area, and they don't reorganise themselves, and that's why the ball's in the back of their net. And that will do it for the first half here at the Theatre of Dreams. So underway again here, the pendulum having already swung United's way. So let's see how the second 45 plays out. And back with Thomas. Ings, but quick thinking defensively. Right, an opportune moment for us to join Alex Scott because there's been a goal as Helen Road, Alex. Oh, just wide of the mark. Goal kick. Well, that never looked like troubling the keeper, did it? But it was worth an effort. A good strike from him. Well, to Alex, apologies for having to interrupt you just then. Just to confirm, Leeds United have scored in that match. And it's now even Steven, 1-1. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. Playing it in. Well, he'd love to have that header back. In fairness, he was being closely watched. Now, plenty of live football coming your way right here on EA TV. That should be a tasty encounter. Plenty of quality in those two sides. Certainly one to enjoy. Take it away. Well, I'm hearing a change to the scoreline in the Everton game. Alex Scott can tell us more. Yep, it's a goal for Everton. It's now 1-0 with 53 minutes played. Thank you, Alex. Oh, that is a superb save. Now, what's the keeper playing at? Well, I think we can call him one mighty relieved goalkeeper. Well, he can smile now, but that was a big blunder. And slipped through beautifully. And a 
and no nonsense clearance. And the timing was perfect. Ball one. Counter attacking very much an option. Well, they seem to be onto something positive, but it faded away. Well, he's thwarted him almost effortlessly. Well, just to point you in the right direction, we have more live action from the Premier League coming up here on EA TV. It's Aston Villa facing Spurs. Can he find the angle? Still possibilities. Not to be advised giving the ball away in that position. He made it look simple, really. An awful lot of green space to run into. Crossed in by Ronaldo. And the post coming to the goalkeeper's aid. Cutting the ball back. This looks more than decent. He'll be breathing a sigh of relief. Ball one. And breaking at pace with Menace. Well, it was such a fluent attack, but they couldn't apply that finishing touch. Well, not the finish he was looking for. But there's another example of their ability on the counter-attack. Nabil Fekir. They're certainly allowing their opponents to come on to them. And back with Thomas. And he's got the beating of his opponent. Crossing opportunity. Well, goal news to bring you from the Everton game. Alex Scott has the details. Can he put it in? Well, what a stop that was. Here's a change for Manchester United. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, he couldn't get the header on the target, but you've got to give credit to the defending. Not to be advised giving the ball away there. Well, apologies to Alex for having to cut her off when we did. To confirm, Norwich did score in that match. And it's now even Steven, 1-1. This is looking threatening. And let's give credit to the defending. Ronaldo. And in with a real chance. And that's the hat-trick. Tearing apart this defence. Tight again they simply can't handle him well here we can see it again and he does so well to skip beyond the defender it just buys him that bit of time to get his shot away that's a really nice goal well if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome surely they now have been removed Running with the ball confidently. It's there for him. Well, he had a lot of ground to cover. Splendid save. And time for the change now. Trying to deliver it accurately. Well, it still could be dangerous. And able to close down the shot. Bodies forward and the break looks on. And space here on the flank. Ronaldo is at the far post. But it wasn't quite as good as it looked when it was played over. Five minutes to go. Far from a good pass. John McGinn. Real chance. Can he convert? And still an opportunity. Cuts it back. Will it be? Oh, there it is! It's one goal after another, and it speaks to the quality of that performance.
Well, here we can see it again. He's shown outstanding vision to find the perfect cutback. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. and out pasting 6-0 So three minutes of stoppage time coming up. Chambers. Ings. Well, they stopped them in their tracks. And there it is, the final whistle. A result to please Manchester United fans around the world. What did you think of their performance as a whole? You're absolutely right, Derek. Their attacking play was excellent, full of energy and pace, and the midfield completely dominated the game. It was a great all-round performance. And the corner has been given. Oh, a goal! And another! 